Hey guys, what is up? Welcome to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be going over non-makeup gift ideas for makeup lovers. For example, for me, it's nearly impossible to actually buy me makeup unless I directly tell you exactly what I want because I have so much makeup. You don't know what I have, you don't know what I don't have, you don't know what I want, all of that. So I put together some non-makeup items that enhance my makeup experience. And these are all items that I would love to receive as a gift. And so I thought I would share them with you guys in case you are stuck. So if you wanna see what those are, then just keep watching. If you're new to my channel and you're just watching this to get some ideas, hello, I am a self-diagnosed makeup hoarder, okay? I really love makeup, makeup is my passion, I collect a lot of different makeup items, all of that good stuff. So I know my stuff when it comes to makeup and so I know some other good stuff that I love that aren't makeup that I think would make great gift ideas. First, so let's start off with a category that I don't like spending makeup on, but I think would make a great gift are brushes. So there's a total of three brands that I think would make great gift ideas. Now these range in prices, they're not going to be the cheapest item ever. I mean, maybe don't get this as a secret Santa gift, you know? But there are three different brands. So the first one, this one is for the girly girl super glam like I don't like spending money on brushes and good brushes are really expensive but they're game changers to your beauty routine so they're very necessary so that's why I think receiving brushes is a great gift because oh my gosh you're gonna love them you're gonna use them you just didn't want to spend your own money on them you know so I would recommend the first brand would be blinged brushes. So these are hand jeweled brushes and the brushes themselves are very nice quality. I in particular love this color. They also have, mine are like thrown throughout my collection everywhere. They have a black one. And then they also just came out in collaboration with Paige Corin, a all pink one. And I kind of want to buy that for myself because it's stunning. But do you see how beautiful these brushes are? Honestly, like I don't really use them because they're so pretty. I don't want to get them dirty. Dirty. They're just the most gorgeous piece of decor. They're great quality brushes to actually use and I mean I would just I would love to receive these as a gift. I think they're absolutely stunning and I highly highly recommend that as a gift idea because again they're they're pricier but I would definitely be extremely thankful to get that as a gift. Now let's get into the other two brush brands. They're both Japanese made brushes and Japanese like handmade in Japan brushes are the best quality, the best in the business. They are real natural hair so maybe that's not everybody's vibe in that case I would recommend going for blinged brushes but as far as natural hair pricey brushes that you don't want to spend your own money on but somebody will really appreciate it Refer and Sony G. I love Refer in particular one for their price point because they're a lot more affordable than other Japanese handmade brushes two they have some really great shapes particularly in the eye category I would suggest maybe looking into their eye brushes. Kinky Sweat has vast knowledge and a lot of amazing in-depth videos if you're looking for more in-depth recommendations as far as refer brushes go. And I'm sorry, I don't have my brushes to show you because they're really immersed in my brush collection. It would take too much time to look for them. But I think as a great basic starter kit that I would recommend to pick up as a gift is the Core Collection. It's $88 right now, which is a fab deal for five natural hair brushes. So you get three eye brushes all of which completely necessary for an everyday routine and then two face brushes extremely soft just really great classic shapes even if they are a makeup lover and they have a lot of brushes these are essential brushes as well that they're going to get used out of because us makeup porters we don't like washing our brushes okay so yeah speaking of which makeup porters I almost forgot to say this another gift idea would be my merch and I said I wasn't gonna push my merch too much but I feel like it's just so fitting into this video legitimately I did just add a different color I changed the lettering to turquoise in case you're interested in that somebody asked me to so I was like you know what okay it won't take that long sweatshirts crew necks they say makeup hoarder that merch idea I think is a really great idea for somebody who loves makeup to kind of poke fun at their addiction maybe that's something you might also want to consider anyways back to the brushes so the core collection is the number one recommendation I have for refer now if it's somebody you really love you know your wife your sister 
or somebody that you want to drop some buckaroos on, Sonia G. You can pick them up at Beautylish. In particular, I love the face brushes from Sonia G, but of course those are the priciest. Looking at the site right now, what is available? I mean, if you want to drop $350, the fundamental brush set, great brushes, the softest most sturdy brushes you will ever feel. I love the Sky Eye Set. That's $160. It's again, really, really fabulous. I love it. She has a new collection coming out very soon. The Kiyaki brush set, which I'm trying to convince myself not to buy, but I think they look stunning, so I might have to buy that. Definitely recommend looking into Sonia G, especially a set, but they are great quality brushes that are going to last your loved one their whole life, so. Great investment. Okay, moving on from brushes, I have kind of brush accessories. A nice little pretty affordable gift that I feel like would be fun for a makeup lover would be to get a solid brush shampoo and a brush cleaning mat. So this is a Sigma one that I've had forever. Now you can actually get an even cheaper one on Amazon. They have dupes of these that are just a few bucks. This I believe is on sale right now on Sigma for 20 something dollars. I'm gonna point you in the direction of Sigma just because this is what I own and it's lasted forever but definitely look into the more affordable ones on Amazon as well you get all different types of textures on here to wash your brushes on not that it really matters honestly I just use the entire mat they keep your sink clean you just paste it down into your sink and you use it to brush your hands before I had this mat I literally was using my hand and it saved me a lot of time you can do multiple brushes at once it's really awesome and then on Beautylish I love the clean apothecary solid brush shampoo they have different scents which is really awesome and it's just really easy I'm not gonna show you mine because it's disgusting but there's like a little bar of soap you just get your wet brushes in here and then put them on the mat and you have nice clean brushes so $15 not a bad price for this I personally love this soap idea and maybe the person you're buying for might not have tried a soap shampoo it's amazing so I feel like this would be a really cute gift in a bag again just something that you wouldn't think of or something that I really kind of wouldn't want to purchase for myself but it's a game changer they would really appreciate it okay, so the next item that I have is a bit more pricey but I love mine. I personally received this as a gift and I think it is amazing if you have like a daughter again for a wife or somebody who has a glam room or they just love makeup. They have space in their house, their room, whatever. Look into the Impressions Vanity Slate cases. They have a lot of different sizes that are available. I have the Gold XL and so I have a corner in my beauty room that is dedicated to my sleigh station. It's amazing. It has lights that you can turn on. It has storage space in the center and you can charge your phone. A lot of times I do my hair there actually, but it's a great portable vanity. It's very, very heavy. I wouldn't travel with mine, but if you get a smaller one, maybe that's an option. I love mine. It's more so for the aesthetic. It's not really a necessary kind of thing, which I think is why it makes a great gift because it's something that is so pretty, so stunning. You're gonna love it and you don't really need to buy something that's really practical as a gift you know treat that somebody to something that they don't need but they're gonna love and I love this I've been asked questions about it I'm going to do a glam room tour very very soon it's like my gold corner of my room I'm obsessed with it I've had that case for a couple of years and I never had anywhere to put it I've been keeping it in a closet and then I finally was able to have my own space and I literally designed my room around giving my sleigh station its own home and I love it so really great gift. Um, another route you could go is makeup organizers. Now, I personally use my organizers from the container store. I love them. They're acrylic drawers, but those are very, very pricey, especially if you actually build a whole unit. So I did find these six drawer makeup storage kits. It's about $42, but it looks really, really great for somebody with a normal size collection. So this one, maybe not for everybody you kind of have to know what space they're working with if they do need more places to store their makeup but I thought that that would be a good idea to mention because I love my container store drawers for my makeup maybe that's a good idea just food for thought you know food for thought I want to get your juices flowing here speaking of makeup organization there is this amazing site you guys called forhervanity.com now I've personally never ordered from here before but I am going to I'm gonna 
gonna tell my mom not to watch this video because I want to buy her something from this website. I'll keep you updated, but I've been following them on Instagram for a while and they create the most adorable makeup organization systems. Brush holders, palette holders, lipstick holders, they have all of that. And it looks like a lot of their stuff is sold out, but it's really, really great. I believe it's a very small company, so you're supporting a smaller brand and they really have adorable makeup storage items. So seriously, please go look into that. I'm really excited to purchase some of my own. <laughs> Another gift idea would be headbands. And I know that sounds a little bit silly, but when we do our makeup or wash our face skincare, we need headbands. I'm gonna link the one that I use for my skincare. It's just this really soft, so it's not, not gonna mess up my curly hair. Hello Kitty headbands, I love it. And it's a few bucks. I'm gonna link the Ulta page, which has a few of these. and then. I I also am gonna put a link to Forever 21. I was looking yesterday, they had some really, really cute ones. Now, I always get asked where I get my headbands from. Mostly, I've gotten them from Forever 21 over the years. So while these aren't available anymore, I get my headbands from Forever 21. These are great stocking stuffers. They're like three to $5. I'm actually gonna make an order very soon to buy some holiday ones for my videos, but also for my kids that I teach, just to wear on camera, something a little bit fine. But anyway, I think headbands are a really really great idea for when a makeup lover does their makeup and Forever 21 is a great place to get cheap ones But I also really love these nice soft ones from Ulta a brand that hopefully I can introduce you to is called My Kit Co They are sold at Beautylish. I got these as a gift last year for Christmas after lusting over them and they have a lot of different kind of bags, but basically they're made for the makeup artist, but even if the person you're buying for is not a makeup artist, I feel like these are just cool bags to have. So the first one I'm gonna show you is kind of a simple one. I haven't had the chance to use it yet, but it's just like a double-sided makeup bag. This one's not as fun, but they have very innovative stuff that is made for a makeup artist. So hopefully if your loved one is a makeup artist, these are perfect. If not, again, so really fun. Look how cool this one is. If I didn't do makeup artistry, I would still want this. This is called the Brush Buddy. So it's easy to clean and I think it's great to have in a beauty room because your brushes won't get dusty this way. So you unzip the top and then you have the brushes that you keep in here. There's organizers that you can take in and out. Uh, there's stuff that you can stuff in the side to so lots of pockets because this is developed for makeup artists. You can wear it as a purse. I love it, I love it, I love it. So maybe this is an idea. This is like a backstage kind of a duffel, which is really cool. You can put tissues in here. If somebody travels a lot, this is perfect. Maybe that gift's not for everybody, but I did want to at least introduce you guys to the brand because they have some really amazing innovative ways that you can travel with your makeup and store your makeup the next one this is just like a fun almost kind of gag gift but something that's actually very useful so let me double check that this is still in stock because it actually might not even be in stock anymore hey okay, we're good it is currently but the color that I purchased recently sold out so they only have one color right now but colored rain has these giant 96 magnetic pan palettes for 50% off, $22. Now the color that they have, the style is not as cute. It's a power collection. I got mine in pink around Black Friday and it looks like it's sold out. But this is just almost like a gag gift because nobody needs a palette this large. It might be fun to send along some indie brand single shadows. Maybe if your makeup lover is in, not into indie brands, introduce them to those really fun formulas. I don't know. I just think it's really funny. $22, it's not a bad price. I think it would make a great gift. Just something that I wanted to share. Alrighty, last and final gift idea that I absolutely love is a skincare fridge. So I have a Kalluli one. It's all white and it's really small and I love putting my skincare in there just when I put my masks in there and I apply the mask to my face. It's really nice and cooling, especially nice in the summer. I know it's not summer, but a skincare fridge is one of those things where I didn't want to spend my own money, but I would love to have one. Maybe that is a great gift to look into. I have mine from the brand Kalluli. Last year, I actually bought my mom a Kalluli fridge as well for her Christmas present. She loved it. And Kaluli 
okay, was kind enough to send me a whole dang fridge to give away to you guys. And I am so jealous of whoever wins this because mine is like a plain white one. And the one that they gave me to give away to you guys is so cute. It's bigger than the one that I have. So take a look at this. This is gonna go to one of you guys, whether you keep it for yourself or use it as a present, give it away. I can't wait for somebody to really enjoy this gorgeous fridge. I had to open it up just to see what it looked like. I was a little bit nosy. I didn't open this box, but this was enough brown box that I was gonna use to send you guys, but I wanted to see what you were getting so I could be more jealous. So yay, that leads us to our giveaway portion. I actually have a few more giveaways that I plan on doing because I've collected stuff to do some pretty big giveaways ways for you guys in order to win this fridge here are the details for this one i am going to keep it just us only because shipping this monster is going to cost me a lot the giveaway is going to end exactly one week from today i'm just going to do it the traditional way that i do my giveaways if you would like to win this little mini fridge you have to follow me Obviously, you have to be subscribed to me, like this video, you have to follow me on Instagram, which is Morgan Turner Makeup, and then make sure you're following Kaluli as well on Instagram, and I want you to comment down below one great gift idea that you are using this year. So what is a great gift that you're giving away? Because I want to copy you. This is selfishly for me only. And make sure when you make your comment, you also type in your Instagram handle because I will message the winner on Instagram. And I want to know who you are, who I can message. So make sure you do that. The giveaway, again, is going to end one week exactly from today. Best of luck to you. I'm really excited for whoever wins this because I'm so jealous. So that is all I have for today's video. I really hope you took something out of it and that it helped you come up with some gift ideas or maybe helped you come up with something to buy yourself <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching if you aren't subscribed to my channel already i would love it if you would consider taking the time to do so and i will see you guys in the next one bye guys have a good one